Bacon and welcome to Titley's Busy Kitchen with me, Titley Nihan. Today I'm going to cook a vegetable tort, which is kind of like a quiche but without the pastry. But the beauty of this recipe is that you can adapt it infinitely to your own personal taste. To make my tort I've got 250 grams of ricotta cheese, 250 grams of mascarpone cheese or any cream cheese will do, 75 grams of freshly grated parmesan cheese, one finely chopped onion, one tablespoon of freshly chopped basil, two crushed cloves of garlic and four eggs. For the vegetables I'm using 100 grams of freshly washed spinach, 150 grams of asparagus and a courgette but you can use other vegetables like broccoli or cauliflower or peas or French beans. It's up to you. I'll start by topping and tailing the courgette, slicing it down the middle and then slicing finely. Then I'll take the asparagus, cut off the tips, then cut the asparagus stems into one inch lengths. Bring a pan of salted water to the boil, add in the asparagus stems and cook for two minutes. After two minutes add in the asparagus tips and boil for another one minute. Then turn off the heat and drain. Heat four tablespoons of oil in a pan over a medium heat. Add in the onions and saute until they're soft. Once the onions have softened and are just starting to go brown, add in the courgette and stir fry until the courgette is soft and golden. Now add in the garlic and cook for one minute. Then add in the spinach and cook for long enough so that the spinach just wilts. That's fine, now I'll turn off the heat, add in the asparagus and the basil or basil depending on where you live in the world, season with salt and pepper, give it a good mix, now leave it to cool. Break the eggs into a bowl, then whisk them lightly. Now add in the ricotta cheese, the mascarpone cheese and 50 grams of the parmesan cheese and mix well. And you should end up with this lovely creamy mixture, mmm, creamy white goodness. When the vegetables have cooled, add them into the cheese and egg mix and mix well. Now take an 8 inch spring form tin or a tin with a pop up bottom and pour in the mixture. Spread the mixture around evenly, sprinkle on the remaining parmesan and then we're going to bake this in the oven at 180 degrees C for about 30 minutes. After 30 minutes the top should be this lovely brown colour and it should wobble slightly when you shake it. Now we'll leave this for 30 minutes to cool. Once the cake has cooled you can remove it from the tin and pop it onto a plate. Now pop this in the fridge for a couple of hours to set. Vegetable tort serve with a nice crispy salad. So now that I've taught you how to make a tort, you can go off and make your own tort and then join me next time in Titley's Busy Kitchen with me, Titley Nihar. Until next time, Khuda Hafiz! Khuda <laughs>